Hi guys, my name is Paul Magalhães. Uh, I'm here today to teach um, something. If you have a kid and you want to teach something at home or when you are in the gym in the open mat or doing something with your son, you can teach him how to do guard. And it's very simple exercise and you can start with like three years old, four years old. Lucas is seven years old, he's big, he already know a little bit about Jiu Jitsu. But you can start with a kid with three years old just teaching the guard concept. The guard concept is stay tight here. Look, and we're going to use a ball, but you can use a teddy bear, anything, a, a toy. And Lucas needs to protect this ball here. I, I, I will try, try to take his ball. So now I am above his guard. He have his legs between me and the ball. So if I try to take his ball now, it's just circle his, his leg and breaking my grip like that. Look, if I try to take your ball, Lucas. Yeah, he will break my grip. If I try to break, yeah, he's breaking my grip. He's always breaking my grip. But as soon as I start, and he always like that, protecting with the feet like that. If I start going sideways, he will touch me with the foot and just follow me. Look, just follow me. If I go to the other side, he's going to do the same. Yeah, look at him. And if I come back, he'll do the same. And if I try to take your ball again, he break the grip. He break the grip. I try to pass your guard. He follow me. And sometimes I'm too fast. And then he use his legs to go inverted and turn around and keep doing. Break. Break. I'm trying to pass the guard. Boom, 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 boom. Try to go to the other side. But I'm too fast for him, and he used the leg to go inverted and recompose. Too fast, lose the leg to go inverted and recompose. In the very beginning, Lucas is smart. He already know what he needs to do. He's doing very good guard. But when you start teaching, especially little kids, like three years old, you can kind of use your hands to drive the kid's feet to go inverted or follow you. Like if I'm coming here and the kid's not using the feet, you can put the feet here, keep the foot. And because the kid, you realize pretty fast. And if I get here and he don't go inverted, I bring his feet and I, I kind of twist him easily, he will understand fast. Kids learn fast. You don't need to speak too much. You don't need to, I'm explaining a lot because you guys are the professors. I'm teaching you how to teach the kid. And you don't need to talk too much with the kid, just show. Make sense? Thank you guys, that's it. Se você assistiu até aqui e gostou do vídeo, dá uma força pro canal, clica no joinha, dá um like aí, se inscreve no canal e até a próxima. Valeu pessoal!